I've been wondering if it was possible to copy a key using a 3D printer. So this is what we're gonna be exploring in this video. It will be interesting to see if the 3D printer is able to print accurately enough and if the PLA material is strong enough. You could try and 3D print the key for these small locks, but I've instead decided to try and print the key for our mailbox. I took a picture from the side of the key that would be the reference image. It really shows the profile of the key. This is how I modeled the key. It was all done using a few measurements and the picture in the background. I sliced the key in Repetier Host and 0.5mm layer height seemed to be the best choice. Here you see the first try right when it's done printing. As you can see the teeth are pretty dull and you will have to clean them up with some kind of a knife. I was wondering if there would be any chance that the key would break off inside the lock. This test shows that the key just bends. It's clear that you have to make the key really accurate for it to work. It takes a lot of trial and error to get it working. I thought that it maybe was the key that wasn't strong enough to turn the lock, so I tried to use this piece of metal. It didn't work at all. In this test had I made a groove in the key where the piece of metal could sit. I thought this could help me turn the key. Once again, it didn't work. It was getting dark outside, but I just had to try one more time. So yes, you can 3D print a working key and you don't need any special printer or any special materials. This was printed in PLA on a TiVo Tarantula. It took about 10 design iterations and a bit of headache. After making the key for the mailbox, I also copied the key to our car and to our house. You can download the files in the video description. You may be wondering what to watch next. I've got a few interesting projects going on this channel that you may be interested in. I'm building a CNC router. I'm building a delivery drone. And I'm also working on a 3D printed RC car. If this interests you, then please consider subscribing.
It really helps me.